Hello everybody, this is a short video about custom domains in Webflow. Uh, there is a beautiful video on the Webflow University. When you click this link here. Uh, when you're new to the Webflow, go to this uh, website and view this video and follow the steps one by one and everything will be fine. So I won't repeat that. The only thing I want to uh, add to this is that when you uh, add a custom domain to your Webflow project, always start uh, your custom domain without the www in front of it. Otherwise there can be some problems with the redirecting of your sites. Uh, what, by, uh, what do I mean by this? Uh, there can be troubles that the www account of your uh, custom domain will work, but uh, the domain without the www won't work. So make sure that your custom domains look exactly like this. Start with, a dom with your domain name without the www, and then this one. Uh, and then everything uh, will work as it's supposed to be. Uh, then make your www default, as the video tells you is the best way to do it, because uh, uh, some servers won't uh, support SSL if you only have a domain name without the www in front of it. And for SEO uh, the canonical name. So, follow the steps in the uh, university uh, video from uh, Webflow and make sure that your uh, custom domains start with a domain name without the www in front of it and then everything will work as it's supposed to be. Okay, that's it. Bye.